Welcome to your back another video today. Today we have an epic unboxing of um B, the B98 God Customized Set. Let's get right into it. Okay guys, for our Beyblade show, we have a dope four pack bay unboxing here um this is not new or anything but you know this is still really really dope look at this um we're just gonna go over the box real quick and then we'll get the pieces out and show you everything i'm not gonna go over too much detail about the box or anything i'm I, i'd rather go over more detail about the bay so right here we got art bahamut a new bay deep chaos just some nice really nice art right there got the bay to cards when we beyblade symbol b98 just says God said and says all the, you know, you know, pieces apart, like dual layer, God, not, not dual layer, God layer, burst system, stuff like that. On the side, we have all the bays and their parts. Just a nice little overview of every single bay. That looks really cool. On the other side, we have um, basically seeing the God abilities of each bay. And I'll go over them later once we actually get the bays out. And the back is just action packed. It says... All the stats to all the base and everything. More about the um, more about the god abilities. Both the bladers. We got Cleo here and Boa. Boa is really cool. He's he's probably a, a lot of people's favorites. Bladers. Comment down below if Bo, Boa is your favorite. All right. So um the parts we got Drain Fafnir Red with a Metal God Ship Seven Star Zephyr. We got Arc Bahamut Two Bump Atomic. We got Deep Chaos, 4 Flow Bearing. We got Tempest Wyvern, 1 with the Metal Gotcha, 1 Meteor Spiral. All right, and just talking about the bays and everything. But it's just a bunch of gimmicks and stuff like that. So, um, let's get right into the boxing. We'll be right back when we have all the bays out. Now we have everything out of the packaging. We have all the stickers here. I personally do not like to put on stickers, but... I'm going to put them on because it obviously makes the base look cooler. So we got Drain Fafnir's, Arc Bahamut's, Deep Cass's, Tempest Wyvern's. Pretty nice, pretty nice. Stickers are just, you know, stickers. Um, then we have the awesome base here. But this thing I want to talk about too. I know I didn't really talk about this in the beginning. Let me get this out. But this is the awesome thing that comes with this too. Not only you get four bays, but you get a god chip remover. I really wanted one of these ba um, things because, you know, we're getting two god chips on each of the two of these bays, and I really, you know, want to, like, throw them on. I'm actually going to try a god chip on Arc Bahamut and see how that goes. I mean, a metal god chip. And this tool is going to help me a lot. So I'm super excited that I got this. So first, well, I'll probably go least exciting to most exciting. You know what? I don't even know which is which. So, but we're gonna. I think I'm gonna go over tempest or tornado wire run first. So let me get his pieces out. There's a layer. Oh, well dope. Disc. I'm gonna hurt the frame. Crap. This packaging is so weird. Okay, talk. Sorry, guys. So this is way more. Here's the, here's the driver. All right, guys, so let's go over all the parts we got here. First, let me put this away. Um, first, we have this epic. It's like green and gold. It's weird. Some parts are gold and some parts are green. Here's the back. It's really dope. It's more it's greenish epic. yellow. Oh, well, yeah, but, I mean, you could call it gold if you want. Um, It's awesome. Obviously, the god gimmick of this bay is the free-spinning layer on the outside. Oh, this bay just looks so nice with the cool metal god ship. Metal god ships are dope. This is so nice. Actually, the Takara Tomi version only comes in a random booster, so this is a nice way to get this bay. Show you the back. The back's real nice. <laughs> yeah, to get the layer at least. Here's the back. Teeth. teeth decent. Not not nothing special. About a defense type's teeth. So oops. This layer is so cool. So shiny. Let's, let's keep dropping it. So shiny, so nice. All right, so next, we have the disc one. Probably not the best for a um, defense layer, but really good attacking weight. I love the disc one. Now we have the frame, star, 
pretty sure. Yeah. yeah. This is me. No, Meteor, not Star. Meteor. My bad. This is Meteor. This is also um Kronos or Alter Cognite Slayer. Comes in this nice. What is this blue? Yeah. Nice, blue really blue. nice blue. Sparkly too. This looks dope. Put it, put it on blue. the table. And then base, and we have the tip spiral. spiral. This looks so nice, so clear. It looks so cool. We got we no, got not spiral. many people say they like spiral. But I actually really like spiral. I think I like it has a lot of stamina for it being an attacking tip. I don't know why everyone would be hating on spiral, but tell me down below if you think spiral is a good or bad driver. It's so nice. It's so clear. It's almost so clear that it's like doesn't look like it has color, but obviously you know. It's like barely any color. All right, we'll put the bay together. Let me put the frame on the disc. Tell, and comment down below, guys, any um battles you want to do. Nothing. And we're be... putting the stickers on after the video because it takes so long. Oh, those teeth don't sound terrible. Dang, they sound pretty good. All right, so there's the bay fully put together, real nice. But I'm not sure how this combo will actually work out. But the I would say the colors are sort of weird. Colors don't really match at all, but the base overall looks really, really nice. All right, I'll just leave that bay in the corner. All right, next bay we're going to probably get is the Drain Fafnir. Because I'm going to get all the stock combo. I think the nothing two stock, be a lot The two bays that are stock combos in this are Deep Chaos and Dark Bahamut, if you didn't already More know. Cooler base. <laughs> yeah. So cool, it's red. It's so cool. All right, here's all getting all the parts up. All right, so here's all the parts. Let's go over it once again. We got this awesome Yo, red Fafnir. Dang, this thing looks so cool. I love the the clear touch on the back. The back looks it good doesn't. Too. It like just makes it, you know, like look so cool. nice. Also, one thing I didn't say is the frame on each of these matches the god ship. I forgot to say that for Tempest Y run. You can tell. I meant tornado. You can tell. Frame matches the metal god ship. Oh, black rubber, clear on the sides, and red. And then we got this sweet metal god ship. This thing is just so nice. <laughs> awesome. Green Fafnir right there. Looks so nice. We got the disc 7, which is a really, really heavy disc. Only a couple other discs, like, I know Zero's heavier, but I don't know any other disc. It's at the seven little points. Really, really, let me put this over there. Really, really solid. Really, really solid disc. We got the frame. This one is Star. This is a new frame to us. We have never gotten this frame because we don't mostly get Hasbro base. And this, this actually looks really nice, too. I'm not sure how this will perform with the points. I'm not sure if it'll help or not, but it looks really, really nice. And finally... We have the tip Zephyr. It comes with Nova Nutrius from with Hasbro. And it's I like this driver a lot. I think it's for an attack type driver. It has tons of stamina. It looks really nice too. Also clear. A little bit of like weird color right here. Well, it's gonna be El Drago. <laughs> it has, it has a good amount of stamina, this tip. Zephyr, a little hole in the middle. So, overall, this bay is really pretty good, too. Yeah, <laughs> it's pretty dope. Let me put I the love frame. the layer. I love this layer. It just looks All so right, cool. All right, so let me see. Let's put it together. I can't wait to hear these drain faff near teeth, bro. Ooh. Right. Oh, crap. Dang. <laughs> oh. Dang. Sounds pretty good. Dang, those teeth sound nice. Here's the bay put together. I like this color. Like, combo way better than the Tornado Wyvern. So, there's the awesome Drain Fafnir. All right. Next bay, I think we're going to go with what? Deep Chaos or Arc Bahamut? Deep? Arc Bahamut. Arc? It's a cooler bit. No, I think we'll save them for last. I'm going to save them for last. All right. So, next, we're going with Deep Chaos. Oh, and also, the, I didn't say, but obviously, the god ability for Spencer. Drain Fafnir <laughs> is the rubber. Let's get all the pieces out. Dang, this packaging is so weird. Jeez. Also, if you guys are wondering where we got this, we got it on eBay for 50 bucks. I That's actually, I think, is a real good price for four bays and a, and, um, a tool. 
So if you guys just definitely just type go on eBay and get it. It it took a while for it to come, but I think it's definitely worth it. Yeah, I was hoping it would come Saturday, but it came ended up coming to Oh my gosh, I can't get this disc out. I couldn't get the disc out. Alright, put the layer on. So um this bag actually has really bad clicks. No, just it's because not, it's not the tip. Not the teeth on the bay, it's more it's the, the driver. Alright, let's see. Here's the bay. Finally got it out of the packaging. Jeez. Jesus. Alright, so here's the layer. Deep chaos. We don't actually have the Hasbro version or the regular chaos, but this looks so nice. I love the, like, it's like a silverish white on the outside. I don't even know what to call that, but it looks so nice. The four eyes right there, I'm not sure if you can even see it. Four eyes, the cool and nice gotcha. From the bottom, it looks real nice. The teeth aren't actually that bad. It's just the driver. It's just the driver. I'm going to leave everything on the table. It's just the driver that makes it burst, if you didn't know. So, here's the ba um, layer. It looks really, really nice. Um, the god ability is basically, if you can see here, the layer, like, bounces. Like this. It goes up and down. It It's supposed to, um like, help when a base coming in. It hits it, and it's supposed to, like... Take the attack better. So if you guys can sort of see the bounce right there. All right, so there's deep chaos. The weight is four. A pretty standard stamina type weight. Just four little points. Nothing really big. I'm just going to sort of skip over that pretty fast. And next, we have the frame flow. We've only seen this on Maximum or Maximus Garuda. Really good. I like this frame a lot. Actually, I think... I think this is one of the better frames besides the new frame we're going to get from this bump. So there's flow. It's supposed to, like, create an updraft. And next, we have the dope driver bearing. And obviously, the god gimmick for this is it. Yeah. What the heck, man? Dang. I don't know. But it's basically, it's this... Plastic made of a special plastic. We had to pause the video real quick, but we're back at it. So we we're going over the this bearing driver. It has so 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 much stamina. But they Takara told me instead of making it OP, put these made these springs right here when you push the bait like this part down, made them super loose. So basically, it doesn't. Make the burst clicks, the yeah, it makes it whatever bay you put on sort of burst a lot, a lot. So basically, this it, there's barely any friction when this is spinning. Like, watch, watch this, right? Look at that. There's like barely, it's so cool. There's barely any friction between this. So basically, this driver has so much stamina, and the special POM plastic right here makes this. The stamina tip basically really, really good with stamina. But Takara told me instead of making it super OP, they made it the springs not super good. I mean, I'm fine with that, but I wish they made it a little better. Yeah, I mean, I'm fine with it, but. Oh, so those teeth bad. are it's so. Like Kirby yeah, those are almost as bad as Guardian Kirbyus or Kirbyus. Here's what I'm gonna do a test real quick. I'm going to do teeth test with that, that driver and a better driver like Zephyr. So let's put, let's listen to the bearing. Yeah, just like guarding Kirby's teeth. And let's listen with Zephyr. It's a lot better with Zephyr. Oh, I'm not sure if you can hear that. But it sounds way better with the Zephyr driver. It sounds way better. So here's the bay, Deep Chaos. Overall looks really, really nice. I like this bay a lot. All right, so the final and last bay we have is Ark Bahamut. Probably the most hyped bay out of this whole set. This bay is so hyped. Can't wait for this bay, I'm so excited. This packaging, bro. Jeez. Look at this. This two is like stuck in here. Look at this. For Hasbro, they just put yeah. strings around the weight. Yeah, why? Like, just like. And they I get, have like glue on them. And 
Because we have like glue on the pieces. Alright, here's the driver. We got the driver. Oh, it's so cool. I love the driver. Yeah. Alright, finally I got it. I got it. Alright, and here's the new frame. Dun, dun, dun. I'm excited frame. for the frame too. New frame right. too. Well, so here's all the pieces to the new bay, Ark Bahama. All right, so let's first go over the layer. This is so nice. It reminds me of um, Kerbius, Kerbius or Kerbius, but basically it's backwards because this bay is left spinning. So basically when it spins, it'll go like this and put up a nice, nice wall for the bay. And I'm going to show you guys what the God ability is. No, It's sort of confusing, but see this green thing right here? The green thing I'm moving with my finger? When the base first start, it's like this, right? You put the weight in. And as it turns during the match, as it gets clicked, right before it, it loses the clicks all the way, right there, the little green piece covers up the holes on every single part of the bay. It goes into, like, it's supposed to help it, you know, gain ultimate defense, but I'm not sure if it really does. But I think that's a cool gimmick. It's supposed to make it, you know, more defensive as it loses click. Um, I think a special move on the show is called Final Guard. And on the show, he clicks a lot, and then at the very end, he puts up the super shield, basically. We have the weight, too. It's it's a, it's a good defensive weight. I mean, yeah. nothing really to say about it. Sort of basic. Sort of like a, almost like a square shape, almost. Is I that even, Killer Death Scythe? Yeah, it's like Death Scythe and um, Satoon. Oh. Can't wait for this. This is the frame bump. It's I, th I've heard it's the heaviest frame in the game right now. Super good. Looks super defensive. It looks just how defensive the layer is. The layer looks super beefy. This looks super beefy. Thing's really cool. It's got little points on all the sides and little holes right here. Imagine if they filled in these little holes. It's sort of hollow right there. If they filled in those holes with plastic, this thing would be super heavy. So that's a frame, new frame bump. And here's the driver, Atomic. And this is probably only driver behind bearing. That has a lot of stamina. It's supposed to be defense driver, but this sucker has so much stamina. All right. And this bay is known to have really bad teeth, but still be really good. So let's put the bay together. I'll show you. It's teeth. These are horrible. Oh my, I can't even hear them. I can't even hear them. I, I can't can hear them. <laughs> that's crazy. So bad. Look at this. Jeez, that's, that's actually really bad. Here's the base the is so good. So basically, I'll show you what I mean. When it get, when it gains clicks, the little green part comes in and sort of like fills out the bay. All right. So overall... All four of these bays on the set are definitely a great deal. I think this set was easily worth the money. If you guys are thinking about picking it up, I definitely say go hit the trigger and buy this set. So, um, comment down below any battles you want us to do with these dope new bays. And um, stay tuned because we have we'll we are getting Screwtron and Spriggan Requiem coming soon. So stay tuned for that. Please like, subscribe, and comment. As always, peace. peace.